All right, in this week's Taste of the Town, Louis Bossies has become the it place on Las Olas Boulevard in Fort Lauderdale. And I've been saying that one for a while, but the restaurant is known for its hip setting, great bar, and truly authentic Italian food. CBS 4's Lisa Petrillo shares a meal with a man behind the name. Chef Louis Bassi is the man behind his namesake popular restaurant here off Las Olas Boulevard in Fort Lauderdale. It's part old world Italian, part hip modern eatery. This 10,000 square foot restaurant with seating inside and out has become the neighborhood hotspot. My favorite place to sit in the piazza, dining al fresco. Some say uh, Italian villa or some say a backyard in Brooklyn somewhere. <laughs> uh, Could be a little of both. Uh, my goal was to really open a restaurant that, that was a foodie restaurant, you know, where chefs go to eat on their days off and and uh, having people from Miami coming up and just have that atmosphere and that culture uh, of a, a real Chicago, New York style restaurant Very where people cool. are uh, eating and having fun. Back in the kitchen, Louis is preparing two dishes he planned for the South Beach Wine and Food Festival's Barilla Italian Bites on the Beach. First, it's hand pulled mozzarella. We're going to just pull it until it's nice and soft and tender, then we're going to submerge it in ice water that is salted. He serves it with baby tomatoes and aged balsamic vinegar. Prepare it with their classic steak tartare. We're going to mix uh, truffle vinaigrette in here. And this is a clean spoon. That's a beautiful thing. Back in the kitchen, Louis seasons up a 14-ounce aged ribeye. All of the steaks are aged in-house. The pastas are homemade from scratch. Have you been a chef your whole life? I have. Uh, I started off uh, making pizza when I was a kid, uh, and I uh, worked my way up through the ranks of the kitchen. Uh, never went to school, uh, so I had no formal training. I just had a passion and desire, and I just love food. At the table, we sample that 14-ounce ribeye with roasted garlic. That kind of melts in your mouth. Yeah, you would think such a thick steak is going to take me a while to talk, but I basically was able to do it right away because yeah. it's so tender and delicious. I mean, this is uh, an incredible piece of steak. The rigatoni bolognese made with chuck roll and ground veal is mouth-watering. You get the texture of the chuck roll, you have the ground veal, the nice texture of the homemade pasta. And it's al dente, which is I love. There's a sweetness of it with the meat, and the sauce is just to die for. I mean, you can get some bread and just sop that up. We'll end on that terrific tartare and the homemade pulled mozzarella served at the festival this year. So that mozzarella is just, the texture is perfect. Why is that? Is it just the way, how cold it was? Yeah, you, gotta, um, you don't want to over pull it. You don't want to under pull it. You want to get it to the right consistency so it's creamy and the texture is soft. Louis Bassi, a true Italian gem in the heart of Fort Lauderdale, opens seven days a week lunch and dinner and brunch on weekends. Lisa Petrillo, CBS 4 News. Well, Louis mm -hmm. Bassi is located at 1032 East Las Olas Boulevard in Fort Lauderdale. And if you're hungry for more taste in the town, check out Las, or Lisa's Digital Bites for our exclusive web series in the entertainment section of CBSMammy.com. That is my favorite, favorite I restaurant. love going there. So, so it's good. such a cool little spot, especially if you can sit outside. Mm -hmm.